Hey loves, Mahania here, and today I'm doing a flip through of my Speckle Fawn Micro TN. And this is the Rustic Kodiak 2 inch spine. So it is super duper chunky. I'm in love. I have found planner piece in this size anyway. So let's get started. I made the bow on the front. And I could do a tutorial if you would like. And the little avatar I made using a app called Super Me. And shout out to Jasmine's plans on Instagram because she actually posted how to, uh, you know, just basically to download this app in order to make your own avatar. The banner I actually made on my computer and I just attached the two. Then I have this beautiful rose gold clip. I actually talked about these clips or showed these clips in my haul video. So if you haven't seen my haul video, I will link that in the description box below for you. So this is the straight sideways pocket. And on the inside, I just have um, a few of my business cards. And I got the cream stitching and the bright the brown elastic. And on the inside, I have a picture of my babies and this clip I purchased from Daiso in a pack of four, I believe, for a dollar fifty. And there is also a sideways, a straight sideways pocket here and I just have a card with some washi just for decoration and here I have a decorative pocket and you can find out all the info on this pocket by watching my tutorial which I will link in the description box as well except for this flower clip I actually got these flowers in a pack of four or five I believe and they are magnets and I just pulled the back off and hot glued it to um, a paper clip okay so this is a piece of vellum and it has a beautiful iridescent shine to it shimmer to it very pretty and then this insert is from Annie's printables I'll leave the link in the description box below and there is a month on two pages and if anyone knows how to properly put these together when you download them and print them out and all that please leave a link in the comment section so that I can watch the tutorial because I could not find one so I did the best that I could so this tracker here I'm most likely going to use that for my children's homeschooling lessons and these are like I don't, I'm not sure I mostly got the downloads for the um, month on two pages in the tracker and I believe this is like a week on two pages. But it just, it doesn't seem like I put it together uh, properly. So, um, yeah, I'm not sure. Let me know. Here, sorry, I have a sheet of vellum right here. It's a gold damask print. And I have like a shimmery watermark effect piece of acetate over this page here which is a sticky note that I purchased from the Dollar Tree and I pulled it off the pad and laminated this just so in case I need to jot down just some highlight of the day and I can just write it down or I can use it as a tracker I really just thought it was very pretty so I laminated and stuck it here and this is just the Ollie clip 
and this is a week on two pages i cannot remember which shop i purchased it from but i will look it up and leave the link in the description box and i showed these pages decorated in a flip through video i'll leave that link as well okay so this is a piece of scrapbook paper and I just used this for the cover of my appointment log. And I believe this was a free download from a blog. If I can access that information again, I definitely will leave the link. But sometimes if you Google free printables, and then you can just downsize them, scale them down to the size of your traveler's notebook. So this is an image that I downloaded from Pinterest and um, I talked about this in my last flip through. I printed this image and had my Cricut cut it out so that it would be precise and laminated her. And this is another one of those flowers from Daiso. And this paper clip is actually from Michaels. And this is a sheet of vellum that I purchased from Hobby Lobby and I just have it clipped to the cover of a notebook and I just jot down notes for websites here that I want to remember but as you can see it's I only have a, a couple of notes in there so then this notebook as you see is my wish list for my family and I and this is a binder clip with elastic hot glued to keep this UB pen in and it is a multi pen and it has 10 different inks in there and it writes exceptionally well you can check out my Instagram because I have a writing sample there and this is just um, lined paper so all the notebooks are lined so this is my shopping list And this one is where I keep tally of my children's stickers that they earn. And this is a mini folder that I made. And that's where I keep the stickers for our uh, behavior chart. And this and symbol is from Michael's. And I still have her in here from my flip through previously. Except for I actually made a more sturdy uh, plastic insert to hold it. You can actually learn how to make this. I will leave the link to Nefertiti Gets Creative video because she has a video showing you how to make inserts and this insert here is a little wallet insert it has a coin pouch here and little slots so I can hold little small post-its in here just get something to show you like that and I ordered this from Lyric Lyrica, I cannot remember the name right now. I'm, I'm drawing a blank, but of course, I'll leave it in the description box. And I ordered this card insert from Amazon, and I believe it was like four between four and six bucks. And it holds plenty of cards. This marker here is from the Dollar Tree. And this is an image that I got from Pinterest and I colored in, I can't remember if I colored in her lips or not, but I did add gold shimmer to her earrings and to her eyelids to give her gold eyeshadow. And actually I did color in her skin. I colored in her skin as well because it was just a black and white image. And I just have another piece of the vellum 
inside the card slot, the DIY card slot, or DIY dashboard is what this is. <coughs> Excuse me. And at the back, as you can see, I have two pockets. And there is the speckled fonds. Oops, the speckled fonds logo right there. Oh, one of my page markers fell out. This is just a mini pocket <laughs> page marker that I made using the Target dollar spot um, pocket, adhesive pockets. It, I folded it over, but I don't know, it's lifting up again, but I mean, it fits. So, there you have it. I'm really impressed with this TN. I'm absolutely in love with it. If I forgot to leave anything out, please leave a comment in the comment section below. And I will be sure to get back to you ASAP. And I will be sure to leave all the links to all the items that I purchased and have a link for in the description box below. So thank you so very much for watching. And I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye.